the power. It's back. Alright, today is a big day because you're getting me to conquer my fears. For a long time, I have not messed with sampling. Partially because I thought it was whack and also a big part because I'm just really not that good at it. But today I got some new toys. I finally decided to go get a couple of old jazz records. We're going to see if I can find some fire on it. Then we're going to do some sampling. Alright, let's do this thing. Hold my hand, guys. I'm scared. Can we find some fire on here, hopefully? Found this old Glenn Miller. Actually, I'm sorry. This isn't Glenn Miller. This is actually Tommy Dorsey Big Band. Let's see. Hopefully, we can find something cool on here. So far, I don't have a lot of hope because this is like an old swing record, so. Alright, now this one here is like a Glenn Miller tribute band or something. Let's see what this one's talking about. So what I just did was I got I just simply recorded all those in the audacity. So now I'm gonna go in here and chop it up on the computer. So I use short circuit. It's compatible by using it with vestige. Um I don't remember if vestige works or not on it on uh, Linux. I can't remember off the top of my head right now. I don't think it does the reason I haven't used it in such a long time, but I have my little MIDI keyboard here. That's the reason how I like uh, doing it up. There's some horns in there. I like anything that's got to do with horns. They're right up there so you can see it. First of all, let me show you something that I haven't found another tutorial on how to actually slice it. So you go right here, this forward, which is why I got it on now just to listen to it. That means that obviously plays it forward when you press it. Then there's forward loop that you can do. So what this does is I'm not going to show you all of these right now. That basically means you can take it one just little tiny piece of it and play it over and over and over again. And there's reverse, that should be pretty self-explanatory. Forward shot, what that means is when you press it, it's going to keep going the whole time. It's not going to stop. So play the entire sample that you've done. No matter how long you hold down the key, you can just tap it. It's going to keep playing the entire thing. So we're just going to use sliced, do hip-hop type sampling. So now that I've shown you kind of how short circuit works, I'm going to be right back with you after I actually come up with something musical so let's take a break here we'll be right back after these messages Two hours later. All right, so I finally figured out something. Let me show you. It's gonna take me a second to get the timing on that right, but. Now 
is the actual fun part now that I got all that sorted out. Like I say, conquering my fears here. Yeah, I'll leave Valdorf alone on this one. Let's see what I got now. The power is back. <laughs> 